Most people don't understand why bad things happen to good people. And it's all about the law of attraction. People don't understand how the universe works. And the law of attraction is love. When you love yourself, you're gonna attract good things for you. That's the law of attraction. We are the creators of this reality and our subconscious mind will create realities that are positive for us when we love ourselves. If I don't love myself, what kind of creations that I, I'm, am I gonna do for me? I'm not gonna create nothing positive for me if I don't love myself. The law of attraction is, is the only rule in this universe. In fact, is the only physical attraction in the whole world. Atoms are together because there is a force that keep the core together with elect electrons around the core which has an attraction and also those atoms uh, attract other atoms to create particles such as the DNA code which, which is essential for life. Now in the next level is gravity. Gravity keep us on the ground and the planet is in circulation around the, the, the sun and the solar system is in balance because of the same law of attraction and the same law of attraction keeps the whole galaxy and the whole universe in constant creation. The same happens with people. People are together and gather because there's a law of attraction. There's love and love is the only rule of the universe and the multi-universe and the quantum field and the other universes that's the only rule that exists and it creates the whole reality yes love love yourself first narcissism is very different from ego ego is a predatory instinct of survival it's nothing to do with love you hear me it's a predatory instinct of, uh, instinct of survival and love is something that you multiply you can love more than one person at the same time the same way parents love one or more children with, with all their heart they can love them all with their whole heart in the different ways in different ways they can love all their children um, monogamy is possible when you love yourself when you actually have that spiritual development very mature monogamy is something that the, the, the humans created we actually create hum, you know things that are supernatural for example we create cars we create internet phones electricity all kind of supernatural things and we created monogamy as a supernatural ability we're not naturally monogamous and very few people are ready for monogamy very very few however we put it as a standard and the society is using that as a way of controlling the mind of many people they they put in their in their minds that the monogamy is the only way for being happy and actually is the least way of being happy you have to develop a lot of qualities before being monogamous um, monogamy requires not being jealous not being possessive not being and that's what actually the society teach every time in their in the mind of the little kids in the mind of everybody possessiveness jealousy fear of loss that's those are buttons to control the whole humanity how do you control millions and millions of powerful human beings how do you do that installing buttons in their brains since we are little kids we're all brainwashed by the education system we're all brainwashed and we need to be aware of the reality the reality is where we're not monogamous our body is not monogamous our mind is supernatural and we can develop supernatural abilities but it requires time it requires a lot of effort so think about it folks thank you for viewing